Dear brothers and sisters, today we want to share an experience that changed our life. Two years back, me and my wife were going through a lot of stress in our personal life and we were about to enter into a state of depression. We were married for eight years, trying for a baby from a long time. There were no medical issues. We were both fit and healthy, but somehow things were not working out. Most of our friends who were of the same age were already blessed. Me and my wife were always positive that our bundle of joy will arrive soon. But the level of pressure and frustration increased with each passing day. In 2019, situation was such that we did not want to interact with anyone, including our family and close friends. We just wanted to stay away from all the conversations related to baby or family. There was so much negativity, imbalance and heaviness around us that every single day appeared like a burden. We used to get thoughts like leaving job, family and moved to an isolated place with nobody around. Late 2019, my sister-in-law mentioned about Sahaj Yoga. She advised us to try it out to get some peace of mind as we were away from family. We didn't think about it for almost two months and then one fine day decided to visit the center without any expectations. As we visited the center, we were made aware of the origin, principles, and cleaning techniques of Sahaj Yoga. We learned some basic techniques, and as we were going out, a motherly voice came from behind. Beta, please wait. Did you like the session? Usually, we were very reserved and never shared our problems with anyone, including our family and friends. But when she started talking with us, we don't know how, but we shared everything with her. It didn't took long for her to understand our plight. And she advised us to try out cleaning techniques for 21 days without thinking about anything. She gave examples about people from her own family who had life-changing experience with Sahaj Yoga. She was so nice, loving and humble that we forgot our agony for a few minutes. We came back without any plans of visiting the center next week. Next morning, I got up early and watched some Sahaj Yoga videos in YouTube. I used Mataji's photo provided in the booklet and tried cleaning my channels. Initially, I could feel some vibrations and heat flowing through my hands. I felt relieved as if I detoxified myself. I could feel the difference and decided to try regularly for a few days. After a week, I tried collective meditation at another center. I felt a lot of positivity and inner peace within me. I continued doing foot soak and meditation for several weeks. There were times I could not do both, but I decided to maintain continuity and do as much as I can. I also motivated my wife to try out foot soak. We attended two collective meditation sessions and got a chance to connect with other Sahaj Yogis. We found ourselves in a better emotional state and felt balanced from inside. Unfortunately, due to COVID outbreak, we were not able to visit center anymore, but continued online sessions. After one month, one fine day, we found out that our bundle of joy is arriving soon. We were not able to believe this and tested twice just to confirm. That day, we realized that we are just instruments. It is mother who does everything. We just need to surrender ourselves into mother's feet with full dedication and everything else works out. We became regular Sahaj Yogis and continued our journey. It was pandemic time and we were all alone without any help. There was so much uncertainty around. 
even doctors were not available for physical checkups due to lockdown. There was a driving force within us that kept us positive and balanced all the time. Finally, our baby arrived on Mahanavmi. Sometimes we feel that it was not Auntie Ji, but it was Sri Mataji who invited us to experience the joy of Sahaj Yoga and the transformation it brings to our life. We didn't believe in miracles before, but now we do. Jai Shri Mataji.